pad. Hi. Welcome back uh, to this door. Dang, hall door. door. All right, I'm going upstairs now. I don't know why the Fat Albert voice came in. That just kind of happened. I love Fat Albert voices. I do too. Back in the. I never. I think I. I only room. watched like maybe two Fat Albert cartoons as a kid, and I always wanted more. I understand that. I had a video this that had like four or five of them on it. Just such a friendly ass guy. Friendly ass kid. Friendly I think he was a kid, guy. right? The idea was that he was like. He was a large child. He was like twelve, but yeah. he was just humongous. He was the biggest kid. He was the biggest kid. He was getting picked on. I don't know what he was doing. Was there he getting picked on, or was he just being big? I think it was just him being big. It was one of those things where it was like it was a. Gr- it, the idea was it was a group of friends where everybody was like cartoonishly exaggerated in weird ways but not right. physically and I, like there was one kid whose hat was like his, his entire head yeah yeah remember yeah that. yeah yeah no there's they were like weirdly yeah it was I, exaggerated f- exaggerated need, style features i, I think i need to read I think I had big about shoes fat too. albert because i feel like there's a Ooh, lot that new like door. oh it is a new door, door. you're right about door. these doors by the way they're definitely mostly it's mostly a new unique. Door. That one's yes, that door. It is. Whoa! Oh, Richard! Oh no! What happened? How oh, fucking no. long have you been here? No shit. This whole place is a killing zone. Yeah, we've been doing most of the killing. There are monsters. What did this to you? A gun. It's a bullet hole. A big snake. A big snake. Oh jeez. Had to be poisonous. Poisonous, Richard. Hold on. I'm just gonna sit here. He's another Bravo team. I saw some, but didn't bring any. I'll go and get it, okay? Oh, is You're that gonna, gonna be what red, and, what green and blue do together, or red and blue? Because blue deals with toxins, right? Or actually, it might just be blue. I'm, I don't know. It's just. A I'm nervous I'm because yeah. I just watched something about deadly animals last night, and if they're in a far enough away right, region right from where the anti venom was made, that, that might not dead. work. Yeah. Anti-venom is like the most convoluted fucking process in the world. Yes. Yeah. We watch like, a lot of, we watch, we watch predominantly, we watch documentaries about deadly animals. 72 so deadly animals <laughs> in various and like parts of the world. like 60 of them are snakes. One of them's a platypus. Yeah, a one of them's a snakes. koala. Most of them are snakes. Some you want to know spiders. what? One of them yeah. is a coconut a lot of them are sharks. crab, that, but that's not believable at all. Oh, man. Just because of how, of like, does it pin, uh, does it like, Pinch really vital spots, like it'll get you in the. They don't. In the they don't bother you artery. until you're already dead as a human. They oh. don't fuck with you. But if you're dead, they'll eat the shit out of you. <laughs> if I'm dead, I don't give a shit what exactly. eats the shit out of me. But they think that uh, they. I mean, they probably ate people with some very vivid imaginations, like myself. Think that maybe, just maybe, the reason that Amelia Earhart's body was never oh, that found she crashed is because coconut her. crabs ate her because she was already dead. And then by that point. If they find, you know, if they there's a skeleton on a beach somewhere that got buried by the surf, and now yeah, there's just like, her bones are somewhere in the ocean or this whatever. This was just the guy that lived on this desert island because there's always a skeleton there mm-hmm. first. It's <laughs> always interesting to me the people the people with conspiracy theories about X Y Z person is still alive. They fake their own death, and it's like the Amelia Earhart one is interesting because it's like, yo, yes, she was she was almost certainly the best pilot alive at the time, if not if not at least in the top whatever. But mistakes There's still happen, and if you're trying to do something as ambitious as flying around the world, odds of something going wrong, pretty high. If you're trying to do it for one of the first times, too. Yeah. Like, like odds of something going wrong are uh, honestly almost 100%. So, yeah, she probably crashed and died, and then shit ate her. Like, Yeah, like coconut crabs. Yep. Coconut crabs. <laughs> I'd be curious, like, my best bet, knowing nothing about the details that have already been figured out about it, is probably that she just flew into a storm that she didn't see coming, and then it fucked her up. Like, my best bet, based on all of the evidence that's been proven to me by National Enquirer, is yep. that she's living on an island with Elvis Presley, so you can go uh, fuck yourself, Rick. Yeah, and now her name fuck. is Janice. Janice? Is that is that a thing? Yes, she faked her, she, she faked her death, and now she's Jan- Janice Prescott. She married Elvis, oh. who's now uh, L- L- Levis. No, I uh, Levis I actually saw I saw recently that Elvis was a homeless man that died not too long ago. Oh, of course. Uh, so <laughs> because if you were literally the most famous musician of all time, you would definitely let yourself become a hobo on the street. 
that no one would recognize. But like people like him. I I don't know what happened. <laughs> I don't know what happened to Elvis and his wife Amelia Earhart. It's hard to say. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, the only reason that people that people keep saying Elvis is alive is because nobody wants to say that he that he shit himself to death. <laughs> Because that like, was the whole thing, wasn't it? Like, he literally strain on the toilet gave him a fucking heart yeah. attack. Which, frankly... All right, I got you, Richard. Yeah. I'm going to give you a shot. Bang. Hang in there. Oh. That would have been a lot more complicated <laughs> had I not killed That'd all the zombies in the way. Oh, that would... I thought that was a fucking grenade for a second. One of those little, like, high-tech grenades. Um. Yep. Let's blow it all to hell. So now you've got a serum for yourself. What? Yeah, you should probably. Uh, just I don't know, but I got. Let me get these herbs. Yeah, <laughs> punch him in his. Oh, delaying, delaying the inevitable. The inevitable. Yeah. I'm gonna say, yeah, you might have been bitten by a snake, but ain't no chance that was a regular ass snake. Wait a minute, can you just kill him? Yeah, can you just shoot him right now? No, I would. That's do that. a bad angle. Oh, I thought that was his eye in the corner, not his <laughs> ear. I was <laughs> like, that is clipping through his fucking head. Uh, I mean, it's still clipping through his head, but still. I wish that was his eye. <laughs> so you can't shoot him though. I don't want to try, man. Why? He's a nice guy, man. I'm Never shoot the dick. <laughs> <gasps> oh, but He's waiting for him to bust through the door or something. Oh! <laughs> like that one? <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's fucking hilarious. Fuck that guy. <sighs> you know what's funny? Oh, no. It's spider webs. Shield. I don't even have Margarita. shield here. Burn it. You know what's funny? Burn it. Uh, dun, dun. The uh, so as a care. kid, I used to hate <laughs> like haunted, not haunted houses, but like the like big Halloween, like the trails, like and Halloween shit. land kind yeah. of stuff. We want to um, go to Spooky World this year. I love Spooky in World case now. You're interested? I, I would love to because I I didn't go for a real long time because I hated it as a kid, and then I went as an adult a couple years like, back, and it was the great. fucking greatest. Yeah. And what used to scare the shit out of me now is just like a, huh, and now it's like just a laugh. I spend the whole yeah. time fucking laughing. I still get so scared, but I think I'm addicted to whatever hormones come out. Like, right? I, like I want to pee my pants, and maybe one day <laughs> I will when I am incontinent. But It's hilarious because the whole idea, it's, it's, it's a similar idea to like roller coasters. You're trying to spike your adrenaline yeah. to give yourself a good a good high. Oh, Essentially, you're giving yourself a high on me. Of adrenaline. Wait, why did you Can say you light it with your lighter? Not on him. Oh. No, I don't want him. What was that accent I just did? <laughs> That's a good question. No, I don't want him. I don't know. If you shoot the candle just right. Oh, there's going to be a zombie here, though. Yeah. There's oh. going to be a motherfucking zombie in there, oh, kid. Boy. Oh, God. That's so much blood. Also, it's too red for the lighting. That Calm is true. down. I feel like, at least with the original version, maybe not with the... Oh, later, bo later dude. Uh, At least in the original... There's no chance they were going to make a separate low-light blood texture, but now... Get off of me! They could have. In 2002 and oh, definitely in 2015, there was oh. no reason to not Are you have dead? that. I died. Shit, when's the last time that we saved? Not too long ago. I think it was before I went to see Richard. I think so. <sighs> oh, that's my old flip phone. That's my old flip phone from... Uh, Jelly Jam. From, from... That I kept because I broke it while doing a show that is related to something that will eventually get brought up. This is a Motorola Razor. It I is believe. a Motorola Razor. That uh, was my Motorola, favorite phone. Motorola. 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 Motorola Laser. Motorola Laser. Major Razor. Major Razor. Uh, yeah, this is this is bringing back memories of all the phones I didn't have in college, though. That was my favorite phone for. I had that phone for a fucking long time. That was like five years. Yeah, this if not longer. My friend Hannah had the pink one. Yeah. And yeah, I always thought it was cool. I had a shitty phone in college, so. I loved it. I still love it. It's like a great size. It's a great the keypad on there. You want to know what I like better about this than a lot of old phones do? Is it feels substantial still? I feel like a yeah, lot of old phones you pick up and it feels like. It's like it's a, it's like a toy. Yeah, yeah you can like just a Tyco chuck piece it. Of yeah, crap, garbage. but this actually feels like a phone still. Yep. Despite its rudimentary form and primordial rudimentary. programming, but yeah, I like it. It's yeah, great. I miss I it. I miss it. it a lot. I mean, smartphones are great. I miss my old phone. Uh, it was one that it was just like a little brick, but if you press the both buttons on the side, a screen would pop up from the top of it. Oh, nice. Yeah, it was pretty cool. I lo That's my cool. phone my phone broke so that was my 
That was actually one of my really good friend's brother's phones. Oh, no. Back in the day when that was pretty viable between most carriers. See, I don't... I. The only ones that I kept were that one, and I think my old iPod Touch is also on the table there. Uh, but I had another one that was like the entire face. It was like right as smartphones were about to become a thing, and nobody knew what the fuck they were doing. Like the whole front screen had stuff, but you but you pressed it and you like slid the screen up, and then underneath was a full keyboard. And I was like, hell yes! I had one of those too. Yeah, I have no idea what the brand was. I no don't think I have those. that anymore. I think actually it might have been a Motorola for me. Motorola. 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 Well, oh, God. That oh, was go. bad. Fucking hell. Thanks, camera. But camera I think I have, Diaz. I think I have my like, my, like, pinch screen pop-up one, and I definitely have the one that I got when I was studying abroad for a year, just because it was well, like... What did she think about you studying? Her? Cool. <laughs> I... <laughs> Oh, uh, all the jokes, except she thought it was great. All right, good. <laughs> Boom. If only, if only, I'm glad that I can make that joke. <laughs> I think she enjoyed everything. Oh, there's Richard. Richard's got problems. Does it ever stop hurting? No, because we did the scene already. Does it ever stop so. hurting? He looks so sad. He really does. He's got the saddest eyes. They're monsters. I feel like they used Elijah Wood's face. Kind of, yeah. It's like from here to here. Oh God, is that Elijah Wood? The place that makes a it look saddest. <laughs> it had to be poisonous. Richard, hold Not his chin. Hold on, Dick. Bring me serum. What is with that haircut? I already brought it to you. Can I just skip you so I can? Jaggy. So where's the shield key? Derner. That is the question. Derner. Yeah, I know. Derner. So, dun, dun. <laughs> does the photograph come up when you're like have a sort of mission or something? I think this is the only mission in the game, but yeah, oh really? Sure. Well, I don't know. There was like a there was an actual thing on the map. Yeah, it was showing me like exactly what space in that room to find the serum. So, because you oh, might be like, oh 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 okay, all right, the shelf with all the medicine on it, which be any obvious. To any Did they do any like treasure photo shit in this one? No, not. It's too old. Yeah, I know stuff. When about, did this though. come out? Uh, the so original original or this one? The original original. 1996. Yeah. How much retooling to like gameplay did they do here? Or I mean, was it just the control system? The control system is different and it's honestly not that great. <laughs> but like as far as like you go into this room and you have to do this thing like did much of the things change? Uh, well, does when that make sense as a question? <laughs> Yeah, like, they added like a whole bunch to the game. They ch they changed some of the puzzles around. They added a lot more. Okay, that's what I was they wondering. They expanded the entire mansion. There's okay, like okay, more okay. Ro there's uh, rooms okay. in this one that, that aren't That was what original. I was wondering. I wasn't sure if it was just like a better looking, no, different it's... controllable kind of game. So there is more to this. Yes. Game. Okay. Got it. This that's, is the yeah. definitive version of the game. Good. Final cut. Yeah. Pro. I just saw I just saw the Kingdom Hearts sitting here. Yeah, and all the Kingdom Hearts. I'm playing a uh, Rechain of Memories for for on streaming. Rechain on streaming. Chain yeah, one more time. On Twitch. I should come and play that because Lord knows no one should ever have to fucking play that game alone. For so real. repetitive. Wait, which one? Chain of Memories. Oh, Chain of Memories. Yeah. Chain of Memories. I that is one of the games I have stopped playing. Uh, I mean, it's it's all right so far. I don't hate it, but. I would come it's, and I would come and play it because it was I played it when it came out. Yeah, and I was so done with it by the time I was on the Game Boy Advance or on yep. the PS3. Yeah, so this this so this time it the the Game Boy motion <laughs> engine is based off of uh, the first Kingdom Hearts game instead of like the Game Boy Advance style, so the camera can freely move and the stuff. That's that was that was a big problem for me with it. Was it really? I felt like if there was a way you could torture people who you kind of like <laughs> still. It would be making them play that game. Oh God, it's just. But you had to kind of like them so still. Hard that <laughs> That's the problem. Is fighting is just fucking difficult. I just felt like everything was so repetitive, and I felt like the things that I was having difficulty with on the Game Boy Advance, at least, yeah, um, were mostly just not difficulty, but like the things I found most repetitive were controls. Okay. And it just felt, I don't know. I just I felt like you could figure a pattern for everything. I don't know. It was. I just got so bored by it. I mean, it. some of them, some of those battles are definitely like do that, then that, then that. I, and, and that's everything. Everything. There's a pattern for every boss, but like, yep. 
I just, oh, God. It was like looking at a cube diagonal the whole time. <laughs> That's all it was. It made me bananas. And, like, I am kind of bummed out that 80% of the story is just a repeat of the story of the first Kingdom Hearts game, but only slightly tweaked to be about memories and stuff. No, I was going to say, it's the first Kingdom Hearts told through flashback, essentially. Kind of, yeah. Also, I'm still struggling with the with the apparent concept that the entire... All of the scenarios that you go to are in Sora's head, I think. But the, everyone has agency still. So I don't understand how that works. I honestly stopped trying to find, <laughs> like, like theory continuity between the games after they made a second game at all. I think... Uh, I feel like Kingdom Hearts is one of those games that I'm just like... Oh, shit! Oh, oh damn no! it. I had him down! I think I th it seems like Rechain of Memories was done not as an excuse, but as like, a, well, we got to put something on the Game Boy Advance. No, I feel like someone was under contract. Yeah, because the rest of the games, I'm told, it pay way better attention to the overall story and have a more cohesive narrative and stuff, and they yeah. don't just retread old stuff. That one came between one and two, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. It goes one, Chain of Memories two, two. and then literally seven more games... Because Kingdom Hearts 3 is the 11th game in the series. Right. What came after uh, 2? Was it... Uh, in no particular order. Days, yep. whatever There's 368 one. over 2. Did that come out... That came out pretty close after, if it didn't come out right after. I have no idea. I feel like some of those 7 must Stream be drop reiteration distance. games, right? Like, uh, no? I think Kai is supposed to be some kind of a re-something. Oh, okay. I was like, what the hell is that noise? <laughs> Someone farted. Is that Richard? No. That's just one of the dudes. All right. So there's, three, there's 380 whatever over whatever yeah. over two. There's, I think it's 358 over two. There's uh, Kai. There's Dream Drop Distance. There's... Oh, boy. That was close. Oh, fuck. No. I don't remember the rest of them off the top of my head. Yeah, I literally probably don't know anything else. Uh, rebirth. Oh, there's Birth by oh. Sleep. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I forgot about that one entirely. I don't think I know anything after yeah, that. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. I don't think ones. I do. But I just love someone posted on Tumblr forever ago that was like, this is the reason Kingdom Hearts confuses people. And it was the first line of the Wikipedia article for Kingdom Hearts 3 that said, Kingdom Hearts 3 is the 11th installment in the Kingdom Hearts series. <laughs> It, it's true, though. All like, right. All right, zombie number two. Where are you going? I'd say just go to the other side of the table. Oh, boy, that was close. <laughs> Leading him around. Is he stuck? I think he's stuck. Can you, Can you shoot him from here? Bang him up right there. Oh, my God. Are you trying to lead him somewhere in particular? Yeah, I'm trying to... Oh, so you're going to light them on fire together. No, I'm not going to light them on fire at all. Oh, he's trying to get them out of your way. Oh. Hey! Yes, musical score. What do you need that for? For the music book that he's had for like an hour. Oh. And that should be everything in the room. Um, yes. Yes. All right. Oh, <laughs>